Hello, this is Comics on Comics. I'm here at the San Diego Comic Con for 2016. I'm walking around doing um, floor interviews today, and my first guest is Andy Nuval. Nordval. No Andy Nordval. Nordval. Yeah. I'm your first man on the floor, huh? For, first man on the floor today. Um, so tell me about your project, Fairy Tale High. Ah, well, um, for years I was working in screenwriting, TV, new media. I co-founded MastersofHumility.com. And then a few years ago, uh, I decided to back away from that and start my first novel. And it's been a long, rewarding, and long process. But it's finally ready, Fairy Tale High. It's a young adult's first book in a trilogy. It's about the sons and daughters of all the famous fairy tale characters forced to go to high school in a world dominated by the villains. Oh. Wow, that sounds like a lot of fun. Yeah, and there's a free sample on Kindle right now. We go. We'll see. Uh, hopefully, that'll pick up, and people will just screen cap it and go there. Uh, but if they can't, so uh, where can they be, they find it? Uh, great thing about Nordval, I'm an easily Googleable name, Googleable ah. name. Great. Ain't nobody else. Yeah, I'll be on a Kindle. I got an author page. Just check me out. And uh, like I said, I just finished it. I'm here to meet with like agents and other writers and network, and see where it goes. So, um, what is your? Uh, how long have you been here? Since Wednesday? No, no. I came in Thursday morning. I, I. I uh, in addition to writing, I also uh, watch some kids. I'm sort of a stay-at-home dad, writing on the side. And uh, I keep thinking I'm going to do Wednesday, but I just I can't leave my kids. I miss my kids. Oh, no, of course, absolutely. So w coming down to San Diego Comic Con, what are some of the things that you want to see this weekend? Uh, well, it's funny. When I first came here, my first few years, I had that wonderful grid that they give you. I had it all highlighted, color-coded. And I just, just stopped doing that. Now I just sort of go and I wander and I see who I meet. And I mean, heck, I'm getting interviewed. I just, you know, if you're part of the cliche, open to the universe. Because uh, yeah. lots of uh, weird universe stuff comes to San Diego this weekend. No, and, and I absolutely remember uh, when I was a kid, I would, you know, go to Comic-Con and do a lot of stuff. And at one point I was like, oh, I'm going to start doing panels. And then it was literally more panels than I had time. You know, and then it's just like, you know what? Why don't we just enjoy ourselves? Come out, leisurely stroll around, and meet people. You know? Yeah, that's true. You, you meet the people who are just here to sell, and it's like they're clearly not having a good time because it just because you know. And and you know, Comic Con is to be enjoyed, even for professionals. It's wonderful. I have a whole group of friends. They're probably all from LA, like me, and yet I only see them once a year. So this is my year to to see all my Comic Con friends and make some new ones. Sweet. Well, Andy, thank you very much. I'll see you around. Thanks, you. Comics on comics. <laughs>